Hello folks, how you doing? Uh, it's me again, Luke. I'm posting another video on the S Epson SF810, my running watch that I'm testing for Epson. I'm now four weeks from my marathon. I, uh, I'm having a great time training at the moment. It's going really well. It's really picking up. I've got two personal bests in the last week. I've got a half marathon personal best. Best ever time for that. I'm thrilled with that. Uh, and also a short distance that I do regularly. I've managed to smash that today. So uh, that's really helping my confidence at the moment. Um, this little watch here has been helping me no end. Um, it's kind of my pit crew. It's been giving me lots of information, statistics, so I can work on you know, how I run and get my technique better. It is really like having a little racing car pit crew to uh, tell me what's going on. One of the things I've started using this week, so I've been getting some live feedback from the watch. The watch has been um, very good at that is using the alarms on it so I've been setting myself a pace alarm for my long distance running so that I stick to the pace I've decided to do uh, and if I dare to waver from that the watch tells me off which is brilliant and it gives a little buzz and changes the screen and I can see I'm being naughty and the other one in, in relation to that was heart rate if I'm running a, a slower pace and I want to keep my heart rate down deliberately uh, for a recovery run or whatever um, I can set the heart rate on this as well and that's been uh, something I've used as well especially in the last few weeks both very useful and, and uh, implemented very well on this watch um, Not to, I must mention again of course that you've got the heart rate thing on the back so you don't need one of these silly strap things on you uh, which I would find quite awkward to be honest um, what else have I been doing this week? yes the, uh, the GPS, I tested the GPS on it um, just out of curiosity to see how it measures up to my old watch and what I found was over a distance of about six kilometers uh, the difference between the two was literally several meters if that um, both very accurate watches both very very accurate GPS watches um, of course one of the advantages of this watch is if you're struggling to get a signal initially you can use your mobile phone to assist it by hooking up to your mobile phone and the mobile phone will help it find its first signal, find those satellites, get you going quicker. Which is brilliant, I've used that a couple of times, very handy. Okay, so that's all I've got for now. I need to go and eat lots and lots of protein and uh, call it an early night. So take care, I'll talk to you soon.